So we picked up Chris's truck yesterday from the body shop and now it is currently sitting at Colorado Car Audio. Mo is getting a sub box installed in it, an iPad dash, which I didn't bring. Oh, sh <clears throat> and wiring up our Kelderman air management. So today I am getting the two air tanks. Um, we are going to be putting all the fittings in right now and then I'm going to be taking these over to Moe's and then installing these. We're going to put them in the bed because we are out of room underneath the truck. And then hopefully by the time I finish this, I'll be able to take the truck and bring it back to the shop to start getting all of the other things that we need to accomplish today. So stay tuned. So we got the, Chris's truck back from Colorado Car Audio and right now we are just in a rush to start getting things finished. I'm gonna start with running all the air lines and then uh, letting all the air out of the truck, hooking up the fittings for it and then hooking up all of our air management um, to get this thing to be able to calibrate. And then uh, as soon as we calibrate it, we're gonna be doing the alignment and just odds and ends on this truck. We got a lot of them, so we'll just get to work and you guys can join us. been working on Chris's truck, getting a lot of things accomplished. As you guys saw, we got it calibrated. Calibration went smoothly. We were able to get set ride height. We adjusted our track width. Uh, now, really, there's just all kinds of little things that we're getting buttoned up. Then we're gonna move on to probably the alignment portion of it. And then once we finish that, then we can put our steering stabilizer on and just a little odd and end things, but right now just getting everything zip tied and ran cleanly. And uh, yeah, things are going pretty good. What do you think about that? It is the last and final day of this build. We have a short list of things to get accomplished. Um, first thing I'm gonna do is we didn't have the balancing beads when we mounted these tires. We already did the fronts, so we're just gonna knock these rears out really quick, pop the balancing beads in them, get this done, and that's one thing off of our list. All this stuff's relatively simple, so we're gonna start with the balancing beads. We got exhaust, torque the wheels, true spiked lug nut caps, alignment, steering stabilizer, plastic Christmas tree clips for the rear fender liners, front plastic fender caps, and then the gooseneck hitch safety hooks. So really super simple list today. As you saw last night, we got some rock lights wired up. We got all of our air lines ran extremely clean. I mean, this is like, you know, you can barely tell there's an air line. It comes up through the coil bucket down. Everything's hidden. Our sensors are all hooked up. Sensor arms are hooked up. So uh, we still have to do alignment with the track bar and drag link, which is pretty simple. We're gonna get things going, so let's start working.
let's just go over some of the things that we have finished up. So we got our wheels torqued, we got our true spike lug nuts on, and we got our exhaust ran, and everything is clearing our track bar. It's super, super close because it's a five inch exhaust, but it should clear all the way through, aired up and down. Um, so yeah, all we really have to do is dual steering stabilizer, and then we are going to replace these plastic caps, and then this truck will be uh, finished. So as you guys see, we have officially got every single thing done on Chris's truck. That was the last thing on the list. Now what we're gonna do is get the gimbal going and we're gonna do some sick rolling shots, so stay tuned.